welcome back to my channel as you can see by the title you guys today i will be um starting on my backyard transformation to include like the patio just everything everything all inclusive um yeah <laughs> i just got back from home depot and i got a lot of stuff from mulch um like a scrub brush like a little um i meant to get a squeegee but i put it back because i wasn't sure if i really needed it um let's see some some um weed netting some some anchors like y'all just a lot a lot of stuff because we have a lot of work to do i haven't i cut the grass like two weeks ago but i'm trying to wait until it gets a little taller before i cut everything um just because i don't i don't want the grass really high but i want it to look like level all across i want it to to grow in thicker and yeah i just I just this summer y'all i want it to actually summer because last summer i was it was really raunchy and i was it was a lot of getting it together but like i have a lot more knowledge now going into this summer and like i said i'm getting a head start or whatever so yeah so let me just give you guys kind of like a tour of what's going on right now and give you like some little shots here and there and I'll let you know what I have done and what I plan to do, and then we can go ahead and get into it. Okay, you guys, so first off, as you can see on the side of the house, we have a mess here, okay? So originally, it was like a hole right here. I don't know if you guys remember, and ice was like digging, 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 and it was muddy, and it just created all this dirt and just nastiness. So um, I finally put like some little pebble rocks underneath, some topped it off with some sand some soil and then put a grass patch there um it still looks a little excuse me it still look you know not pleasant right now but i'm still gonna go across here with some more um some sand some soil and some more patches to fill that in and i'm also going to be scrubbing down all of the fencing and cleaning it off so we can get get it to be that beautiful white color that it originally was uh, and then here I'm going to, I don't know if you guys remember, but how I did the front yard, trim out the entire back, um, you know, just so we can get some separation from where the mulch will be and where the grass is. Clean off, yeah, trim this up completely, even around this, um, what is it, air conditioner, whatever, just so we can, you know, keep it clean over here because i've noticed like on the front of the house like having the mulch the rubber mulch it just like keeps everything intact and so much more cleaner um yeah so we're going to do it all down here and along with um along with scrubbing down the fence and everything i'm going to scrub down you know the lower towards the end of the wall and since my house is majority white with black trim it is starting to yellow because it's um kind of like dirty down there um so what I'm going to do, I'm not going to paint the entire house, but I did grab some stucco paint, um, which is what this material of the house is. Um, I'm going to spot paint it like that white color so we can just freshen it up and just make it, you know, all cohesive and clean. I'm going to clean up everything down there, you know, just give everything a cool wipe down. Cause like I said, it was a lot of like just bare, like mud instead of stuff being here so like when it rained or a storm and stuff like the water splashed back up and it just get the you know whole side of the house back of the house dirty and stuff like that so like i said trimming it off and adding that much is really going to take care of it so like i won't have to worry about that as much moving on down i'm going to go ahead and clean this good mirror uh this window off um clean all that off as well um as you can see ice is was part of I, I don't know if she was part of the problem but it was like this part right here was just like how that was but it was much bigger i laid these patches down like a week or so ago and now it's already like feeling in pretty good or whatever but i have a lot more and if i need more i'm gonna get more um patches just to fill in all the bare spots i don't know if you guys remember but it used to be a tree down here so I'm going to make sure, like I said, I add the sand and soil to there before I add the patches along with, you know, any other bare spot down here. Um, no, I did not, like I said, cut the grass yesterday, but I did um, purchase a weed eater and I trimmed all of the grass that was like growing behind the gate. Um, some of my neighbors actually have like 
gates that you can access the back like i know it's nowhere to go but it was smart because that it allows them to mow um right behind it but since i didn't um do that just yet i just went ahead and um used the weed eater and it worked perfectly fine y'all like i was able to get it all you know done and i know if like the grass is perfectly cut like it would just give you know like yeah but anyways it's a work in progress i'm moving along i'm going to go ahead and do the same to this side trimming everything out adding the mulch cleaning down the house spot cleaning where it needed wiping the mirror i mean the uh, i don't know why i keep saying mirrors cleaning the windows um cleaning the fence down on both sides and let's go back over here i'm just gonna be the last like the last area that i touch up hopefully i'll be able to get to it all today but if not if i do i'll be able to uh, i have a power washer but i've never used it myself so i'm gonna try it give it a try and see if it actually works um yeah go ahead and clean this off as well and then as you can see guys there's like black trim around here and then like the sliding door is this aluminum i'm going to tape that off um tape off the meat or the glass and everything and i'm going to spray paint the aluminum black because i just like the blackness <laughs> So I'm going to have to cover that up too because I think I actually want that to stay white. But yeah, just clean everything up really nicely. Paint the bottom brick that runs across the bottom of the, um, the door. And once everything is done, I will paint the, um, what is this, the concrete, the regular flooring, the regular like gray color or whatever concrete is supposed to be. Um, I got the material for that too. I'm just going to scrub it up real good. Blow it, um, use a leaf blower to blow off the debris or sweep. Um, just make sure it's really, really a clean base. I'm going to tape it off, like create like a tape dam. So like it'll be tape, but it'll be like higher up so that if something right off of the patio like decides to blow, then it'll be kind of like a barrier. So I'm going to do that all the way around. So while I, um, paint everything and take that off too so i paint everything and just be you know super clean probably do a couple coats of that paint and then you guys i'll be ready for furniture and my fan that's gonna go up there right now it's just this um, this little light fixture right here but um while i was at home depot i actually just ran into this fan that i was looking at online i saw it in person and i was like okay now i can do this you know i was i was kind of like in between two but i saw the one in person and it was super cute and then it's like remote operator so i don't have to you know pull it a little tassel or whatever i can just you know operate from the couch or the seating arrangement or whatever that i'm having um let's see what else um i can kind of like tell you guys about the decor oh it's been 10 minutes i've been running my mouth <laughs> but Right here, there's a um, uh, socket or whatever, like for um, a cable line to run through. Um, I don't really have cable, y'all. I just use Wi Fi because I only watch Netflix or YouTube. Um, in the near future, I may upgrade to cable. I don't really know. I don't really care. To, I don't because I literally don't use it. Or, but I mean, yeah. There's <laughs> a socket up here, so I can um, install my um, TV up here. And right now, I don't know what's going to go down the bottom of it. I kind of like want to hide this um, socket right here. Like, at first I was thinking like a wet bar situation, like a built-in, but <sighs> I don't really know. I don't really know. But I kind of got an idea of the furniture I'm going to get. Um, I'm going to wait until it actually arrives and then you guys can see the whole thing yeah it's been quite some time now since i'm running my mouth but i just want to give you guys kind of like an overview as per usual of what i'm going to be tackling today i have a lot to do it is like 11 o'clock right now 11 12 ish and it's hot but i'm just excited for it all to come together so i can just not be so embarrassed about my backyard because this is not it right now but without further ado if you are interested in seeing how i do this complete backyard patio transformation then please keep watching
I be so sick of you niggas, y'all can't you think, I be so bold myself when you come and fuck me. I feel so ordinary, said when you won't round me. Treat me like all the right, wear me out. Arguments, you air me out. Trip about your whereabouts, and I can keep no conflict with you. What can we just rub it out? I don't want no sad with you, you know you my thug, and I can't shake this habit, no. Oh, 
her and now you in her way. You know? You know what I'm saying? Oh. Of the sun. Of the sun, yeah. The sun. I'm great. You know a little tan essential. Yeah. All right. Bye, babe. That might She a real bad bitch. Got her own money. She don't need no dig on the dance floor. She had two, three drinks. This is her kitchen. Throw it out and come back. So you guys um, saw like how the art was previously, um, where it went, and <laughs> like all of that was last year, I think like, yeah, <clears throat> all of that was pretty much last year, and now I'm finally at a point to where I can finish what I started off. Um, it doesn't look like that <laughs> right now because so much has happened and then like the dogs, they just get into stuff, but I am determined to get majority of everything done this weekend. And then like, you know, maybe the decorating of it, like the furniture and all that good stuff, maybe that'll be a different day. But for sure, <clears throat> I wanna do the cleaning up the yard today because um, I'm tired of it looking crazy. So hold on, let me put my shoes on. So, I'm outside. Ugh. Don't want to do this, but I'm going to just show y'all real quick how everything's looking. Don't judge me because I know it's not cute. But that's why we're out here fixing it. Let's start from one side. Go across the yard. Ghost, please don't jump on me, sir. Okay, so this is one side. As you can see, like, the mulch has been, like, dug up. Because when he was younger, like, he's still a baby, obviously. But much smaller, he would come over here and think this is the zone to play. And it's not. <laughs> so, I have to... I have more bags of mulch. I just have to... Um, basically, just clean this up, but lay more mulch. Pull up different weeds and stuff. Um, this wall isn't that bad as far as being dirty, but in areas because like when when I like leave them outside for a little bit, <clears throat> they get all psychotic and jump on the wall. So like this is disgusting, I know. <sighs> but like having a house could be super difficult. You have to like even if you just say you clean. And then you leave it and you never come out. It still gets dirty because the element. Because I fill this up, pick all the weeds up. Um, this too, you see like he digs holes. Like the grass was good. But then he came along and just tried to ruin my life. So I need to get some patches <clears throat> for these parts. Um, treat it a little bit. Like put some stuff down. Once I do the yard this weekend, then it's off limits for them until all of this grows. I'm gonna just walk them more instead of bringing them out. Um, I need to do this area. Clean all that. And like you see, they just jump up on there. So it's like a horror movie <laughs> situation. I need to clean all of this, y'all. Like the mirror, not the mirror, the, um, the window. Reprint this black. I did a lot of projects out here, kind of like in my garage. Like when I do projects and I spray paint, and I didn't put anything down there. Like it looks like this now. So after I do this, no more projects back here. Um, but I have the paint already for this. Um, it's like freaking what is it? Uh, wasp nest over there. Like 
I have to put a fan up here. I want a fan out here, not just a light. Um, another hole that he's dug. I don't know what's wrong with him, why he think it's okay. Let's see. This over here is a tad bit better, but it's still like ugly. <laughs> of course. <clears throat> um, yeah. I definitely have my work cut out for me today, y'all. <sighs> but let me get it done. I was charging up the lawnmower. It should be fully charged now. I know one of the batteries are. Um, hopefully the other one is. So by the time I'm done, if it runs out, then you know I'll do that. But I'm planning to cut the guard, cut the guard, cut the yard, cut the grass. That's what I'm gonna do to clean. I'm gonna clean one side, probably that side. Then I'm gonna do all of this, and then that side, and then lay the mulch. Wait till this patio dries and paint this out. Well, well, I'll be gonna clean this and clean the mirror and everything. I mean the window, and then I'll lay the mulch. I don't feel like doing it, y'all, but like it needs to be done. Real bad because I feel like once I get the backyard under control like i was saying in a previous video i feel like the traffic in and out won't be as bad as far as like being dirty because it's just mud and i mean it's not mud just mud but it's a lot of mud but like once i get that together like them coming in and out the house i feel like they won't be tracking mud <laughs> they probably be on a freaking patio furniture especially him let me see him, because he got to be. Come here, son. Come here, Gus. He just, like, runs into me. Sit down. Goes. Oh, my God. Sit down. Goes. Can you sit down? Sit. 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 <laughs> Gus. Sit. Ah, ah. Sit. Thank you. Like, look at him. <laughs> like, son. And he won't leave ice alone. Like, he's too big to be just running into her like that. Ghost, get off my trap. You okay, Ice? You okay, Punky? He crazy. <sighs> it's me procrastinating still. <laughs> but, okay, I'm about to get it. I'm gonna put like a long sleeve shirt on because I feel like the bugs go try to get me. But let me let me start. Um yeah, I'll see y'all in the field. So, uh, my camera died, so I really didn't get any footage on here, but I did, like, get some on my phone, um, but this is what it's looking like now over here. Y'all probably can't really tell the difference, but it looks so much cleaner, and I'm not gonna lie, the power washer is super strong because, like, right here, like, I had it right here for a long time, and it just, like, low-key broke it up. <laughs> <laughs> try not to get too close when you're doing it and like just other parts of it as well so there's a concrete but i know it doesn't look perfect i'm going to um paint this out anyway um i have concrete paint um in the garage so yeah but 
as I was cleaning this, like I ended up like pointing it down and I was, and then it was like, you know, the, 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 the what is it? Pressure washer thing. Like when it started to do the thing that it does and it was doing that. I'm like, hold on. So, um, I cleaned one side and this not even me being tedious. See, look at this. This is just so powerful. Like <clears throat> it broke up some of the concrete, but <clears throat> Yeah, I was doing this, and then, like I said, boom. So, I was like, let me at least do one side. So, this is one side, and this is the other. Like, crazy, crazy difference. But, I don't know. Like, it took me a minute to actually get the power washer to work. I thought it was broken, but I found a YouTube video, and I figured out how to operate it. And I'm so happy because, like, let me show, show one more thing. Um, so I can go ahead and finish the rest of it <clears throat> but the main thing that I'm concerned about is like up here can y'all see oh it's a box over here it's like over here so what I think happens is right when this was filled like when this was okay I didn't have an issue but ghost came and he like dug holes so when it rained I feel like the water splashes and splashes back up and that what gets this dirty um that's just my theory but the last time as y'all can see um when i was cleaning it i had a bucket some solution a water scrubber and i was just doing it and it was like time consuming it was hot my arms was hurting for being over my head but like i got it done but when i put this bad boy on this part I was like, and it just came off, y'all. I just was like, thank you, God, because he know I'm about to do the rest of this. Um, So it's actually about to start getting late. <clears throat> so I'm trying to go ahead and finish the rest of this side and the rest of the inside of here, too, so that tomorrow is just a simple doing the outsides of, like, not the outside. Obviously, it's the outside, but, like, doing the sides of the house, the fence, and everything, and just so I can finish up, wrap up everything here. But I wanted to wake up in the morning and this to be dry so that I can just tape it off like the edges and go ahead and paint so it's at least one coat of paint on. I don't know if I'll be able to do the second one tomorrow because I don't know how long it's going to take that paint to dry. But at least I have one. But yeah, I'm just so happy that I got it to work, like I said, because y'all now i know i can keep my house clean by being you know being power washed because i thought that every so often i was gonna have to have someone come out and power wash my house and it's like that probably can get expensive and on top of that my house is white so you know with the black or whatever but it's mostly like majority white and it'll be easier to get dirty faster well, over time, like, and you'll be able to definitely see it compared to the other houses that's a, that are on the street. But, yeah, I'm so excited to finish this up. And then I'm happy to go ahead and do the front of the house. It's not disgusting, but, like, you can kind of see, like, where wasps nests have been. And then it, like, it's, it's just not cute. Like, I just want it to be back perfect, like, how it was when I first got it. And I just, I'm just so grateful, so happy that I got it to work because I know I can basically upkeep the maintenance on it. I feel like I'm saying the same thing, y'all, but I'm just really happy. But anyways, I'm going to give y'all another look. And then I'm going to do the rest of this. And then I'm going to house. <clears throat> Matter of fact, let me just give y'all and then I keep running my mouth. But... This just looks so good. I don't know if y'all can tell, but this just looks so good. So pure. Mm. This just looks so good. Like, it was a wasp nest up here. It was just all cobwebs. It was just nasty. Like, it just wasn't cute. And I'm going to spray this down, but I'm still going to replace that. I cleaned this out. And I'm going to slide this entire thing open and, like, wipe up the water that's on the inside of the track um just so it won't like you know just be sitting there overnight um and then i went ahead and spiral spiral 
power wash the windows i'll wipe them down tomorrow with like some um glass cleaner and then i did some of the ceiling but i still have um now that i look kind of up some stuff up there i'll probably get a ladder and get everything up there like i cleaned around the camera because that was looking real it was just looking real bad like when i tell y'all the dogs be going ham back here like they real life do real life do just messing up my whole situation out here but yeah um after i finish this since it is gonna be late i don't want to just completely just put stuff down like if i could do something else i'm gonna go ahead and do it like look at this oh i'm baffled that it looks like this but well, it's a better view i feel like y'all see that this compared to this like come on now like this whole side of the house compared to okay it just looked brighter over here in my opinion or maybe i'm tripping but i don't know i just feel like it looks good but yeah y'all see all that hold on it's probably can't focus because i'm moving but yeah that it just ugh, it just looks so nasty and this it just it just doesn't give right now and i need it to give but <clears throat> everything's gonna be so cute um here and this here soon the clean the gate doesn't look bad but i'm gonna still go ahead and power wash the gate down and <sighs> yeah it's just i'm gonna get it right i'm gonna get up early and i'm gonna start early so that i can finish before tomorrow is over like i honestly didn't start i think until like two three ish p.m and even then i was on and off procrastinating because i was cutting the grass like i studied cutting the grass at three um and edging and all that stuff so it's like it's not even a full day's worth of me power washing but it's like ugh, tomorrow me starting on this ugh, i know i can do the whole back and like sides of the house and the gate um i'll leave the front of the house maybe next weekend or something it just depends on how fast I go because if it's hella fast, I might just go ahead and work on the front like more towards where the garage is and get that real nice and cute. But y'all, I'm just so full of happiness and I'm just, oh my God, this dragonfly trying to fucking get me. But, uh, but yeah, I'm just so happy, so excited just for this backyard situation to come together because like y'all... I just want to enjoy my, I just want to enjoy every inch of my house, like every piece of space possible. I want to enjoy it, but I haven't been able to enjoy it because it hasn't been up to par like I want. So like, that's why I, every weekend, like I'm trying to show y'all some different that's been done. Like y'all, because I'm really serious. I'm sorry y'all duck because the dragonfly going crazy back here, but I'm really super serious about, um, just getting my house done like if i can't if it's up to me i'm honestly just gonna do this whole giant this year so next year it's just me enjoying the house and yeah i might be doing like not more so projects but like decorating of course next year because i feel like the decorating will for real, for real never end it's just the the diys like the the trim on the walls and stuff i feel like that can come to an end eventually but I don't know, like, <laughs> yes, y'all, this is, this is it, oh, I'm just so excited, but, um, yeah, again, I'm gonna knock this out, and then when it gets dark, I'm gonna go ahead and go to Walmart, and grab some more, um, what's it called, bags of mulch, and I have these little, I'm gonna show y'all what it look like, <laughs> these right here, these little concrete rings and what they do is they just um surround the sprinkler so that like as the grass grows and stuff like that um it won't go missing like once it when you turn the sprinkles on it'll pop up and it'll be surrounded by this concrete ring or whatever so yeah i'm gonna get a couple of those some mulch bags of mulch and then I'm going to go ahead and get some grass patches as well. So I can just fill in all of these gaps. And yeah, I'm going to treat it. Have some lights. 
I'll do the lights in the, in the TV and all that good stuff in another video. But this one is pretty much me just cleaning up the backyard. <laughs> so, let me stop rambling. I'm so excited, but I'm going to finish this up. So, I can go to the store. Bye.
paycheck Running back to the strip club I'm never going back, never going back No, you can't make me Never going back, never going back They never take me I've been enough of petty dudes i put enough of shitty news I had a thing for dirty shoes Since I was 10, love dirty men are like Ooh, better day than cash today Ooh, I just take it day by day